Hey, welcome back guys. In this review, we'll be looking at the three fabric armchairs from Ikea that are under 200 bucks. We will start with the Binksta armchair and move on to the Vivid Remsta, and then we'll finish it off by taking a look at the classic Poang. After our review, we will rate each fabric armchair using the OFR rating system. So let's not waste any time and jump right in. The first fabric armchair that we're going to look at is the Binksta. It comes in two different colors. Dark gray, which is this color, and dark yellow. The pictures on IKEA's website of the dark yellow Bingsta armchair look more orange than yellow to us. The materials that are used in this armchair are poplar plywood, polyurethane foam, and high resilient polyurethane foam. The legs are made up of steel and the fabric is made up of 100% polyester. When you are sitting in this armchair, you feel like you're concealed from the environment due to the big back panel. This armchair would be good for reading and if you want to watch movies on your laptop. Overall, it's comfortable when you're sitting in the Bingsta. The back panel is kind of hard, but when you're leaning back, it does support you well. The fixed seat and the loose cushion do feel like they are better quality in comparison to other foams used by IKEA. That saying though, we would like to find out how it holds over time. The armrests are at a good height and are pretty comfortable. You can rest your arms for longer periods of time without feeling discomfort. One of the drawbacks is that the material isn't tight around the seat cushion. The polyester does tend to wrinkle after some use in certain areas. Also, if you're a taller person, it tends to be uncomfortable when you lean your head back. Like I said before, the back panel is pretty hard so your neck does feel strained. If you're a shorter person, this problem won't apply to you. The height of this armchair from the ground to the top of the fixed seat is about 17 inches. If you're interested, you can grab this Bingsta armchair for $169 Canadian. It took us about 20 minutes to assemble the armchair and we had no problems with the instructions. If you're transporting it yourself, the Bingsta armchair comes in one box and its dimensions are 30 and a quarter inches long, 30 inches wide, and 11 and a half inches tall. Plus, we made a tutorial on how to build it. Click the link in the description below if you want to check it out. Now, let's move on to the Remsta armchair. To us, it's the best looking out of the three. The Remsta comes in three different colors. They are dark green blue, which is this color, dark gray, and yellow beige. The materials that are used for the Remsta are particle board, solid pine, fiber board, and different types of polyurethane foam. The legs are made up of solid birch with stain and a clear lacquer finish applied to it. The fabric of this armchair is a combination that's made up of polyester, viscose, and rayon. This fabric is a bit better than the other chairs, but there are a few drawbacks. If you have pets running around that shed, this fabric does tend to make their hair stick to it a lot. Also, you have to look at it more carefully than other fabrics. You basically treat it like you would treat any other velvet product. IKEA does provide instructions on how to clean and take care of the material composition. We honestly don't know why IKEA calls it an armchair. This chair would be good if you're a person that has miniature forearms. When you place your arms on the armrest, it's not comfortable at all. Most likely the armrests are more for aesthetic purposes than function. The overall comfort level of the Remsta chair when sitting is decent. The seat does come with thicker foam and the backrest does support you well. The one drawback of this chair is that the seat does tend to cave in a bit. The back of the seat where the armchair supports most of your weight, the polyurethane foam isn't dense enough so you do sink into it more than you would like. Also, the height of the Remsta chair from the ground to the top of the seat is about 17 inches. You can grab this chair for $199 Canadian at your nearest IKEA store. The instructions were really easy to follow as you only need to secure the legs to the armchair. It took us about 12 minutes to put the armchair together. The box dimensions for this armchair is 29 and a half inches in length, 28 and a quarter inches in width, and 26 and three quarter inches tall. You'll have troubles transporting it if you have a small cart. You can always take it out of the box though when taking it home. Lastly, let's take a look at the Poang. This armchair design has been selling at IKEA for more than 40 years. You can pick three different frame colors, which are black, brown, clear, and brown. There are eight different fabric colors for the Poang armchair. The model that's shown has the Vislanda black and white cover with the brown frame. The cushion for this model is made up of 100% cotton and polyurethane foam. The frame is made up of layered glued wood veneer with the surface being made up of birch veneer. This model does come with an attachable head cushion for additional comfort. The only thing that holds the cushion to the frame is a strip of Velcro. Over time, that may cause problems as Velcro does tend to lose its sticking abilities. Overall, the comfort level of this armchair isn't anything special. Initially, when looking at the armchair, you see the design as being intended for a person to lean back in. The material doesn't create that relaxing feeling. The cushion also sticks out and doesn't cover the whole frame. It tends to rub against the back of your knees. The armrests are wide though, so your forearms have good support. The drawback is, it's made up of wood, so after a while, your forearms and elbows tend to get a bit stiff. The height of the front part of the seat is about 17 inches, and the lowest part of the seat is about 13 inches. You can buy this Poang armchair for $179 Canadian. The instructions were really easy to follow, and the whole build took us about 27 minutes to finish. It comes in two packages, one being the cushion and the other being the frame. The dimensions of the box in which the frame comes in is 28 inches long, 26 inches in width, and 2 and 3 quarter inches tall. 
You won't have any troubles transporting this armchair, even if you have a smaller size car. If we had to decide, we would go with the Bingster armchair since it's pretty comfortable. The fixed cover can be washed, so if spills do occur, you have the ability to remove them. Also, the seat is made up of high resilient polyurethane foam, which makes it have a more solid feel to it when comparing it to other armchairs. That's why we liked it the best. Now moving on to the OFR rating system. We rate the comfortability of the Bingster armchair a 4 out of 5. It does come with high resilient polyurethane foam and the armrests are padded. We rate the performance a 5 out of 5 since the whole structure is solid. The instructions were easy to follow, so we give it a 5 out of 5 on complexity of the build. The overall style is a bit odd to us, so we give it a 3.5 out of 5. For the overall value, we give it a 4 out of 5. For what you get, the price of the armchair is pretty good. So, the overall score for the Bingsta armchair is a 4.3 out of 5. Now, for the Remsta armchair, we rate the comfort a 3.5 out of 5 since the foam does tend to cave in a bit when sitting. Also, the armrests are not functional. We rate the complexity of the build a 5 out of 5. The instructions were really easy to follow. The performance of this chair is a 5 out of 5. It's a sturdy armchair overall. We give the style a 4.5 out of 5 as it does come in 3 different colors and it has a velvet finish to it. We give it a 3 out of 5 on value. The price is a bit too much for the lack of armrests and the comfort level. Overall, we rate this armchair a 4.2 out of 5. Finally, for the Poang armchair, we give it a 2.5 out of 5 on comfort. The foam doesn't create that snug feeling, especially when the armchair has that lean back style. The only thing that holds the cushion to the frame is a strip of velcro, so we give it a 3.5 out of 5 on performance. We had no troubles in reading the instructions, so we give it a 5 out of 5 on complexity of build. We like the lounge and lean back style of this armchair, so we give it a 4 out of 5. We give it a 3.5 out of 5 on value. The model isn't that comfortable, but it looks nice. The overall score for the Poang armchair is a 3.7 out of 5. Smash that like button if you enjoyed the video, and screw that subscribe button if you want to see more furniture review videos.